Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro, and today we're going to take a look at running Hostmon on Windows. So the first thing we're going to do is go out to GitHub and download the Hostmon source code, and then download the Node.js Windows installer. Next, we're going to run the Node.js installer, accepting all the defaults. Once Node.js is installed, extract the downloaded Hostmon source code. Rename the extracted folder to Hostmon, and then cut the entire folder into C program files. Navigate into the Hostmon folder and while holding shift, right click in the white space and open PowerShell window here. Run the npm install command to download the required dependencies. Then run npm audit fix to fix known vulnerabilities. Run node space slash server js to start the hostmon process. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the host colon 3000 to reach the hostmon web UI. Well that's all that's required to get hostmon running, let's take it a step further and get hostmon to start up when the system boots. Click the start menu and search for task scheduler. Right click the task schedule library folder, create basic task. Give the task a name and click next. Set the trigger to when the computer starts. Select start a program and click next. Here we'll complete the form to run node.exe and point it to the server.js file in the hostmon directory. Click next, then check the box to open the properties dialog and click finish. In the Properties dialog, we want to check the box to run with highest privileges and set the user to System. Click OK to close the Properties dialog. With the Scheduled Task Configure, right-click on it and select Run. Now if we start Task Manager, we should see the Node.exe process running. Go back to the browser and refresh the Hostmon tab we had opened earlier. Welcome to Hostmon running on your Windows device. 